possibly be the reason why uh, some of these Asian countries that study English as a second language, I'm taking example of like the Chinese, the Thais, and even the Koreans, um, they are so crazy about native speakers. When they hear the word native speaker, it's like they should sleep on the floor and let the person walk on them. What can possibly be the reason for that? Well, I'll say the first thing is that they consider white people, let me not just call it native speakers, consider them superior. Yeah. The Asians themselves, when they meet white people, they feel inferior. Exactly. So they look at them like they're superior. Yeah. And they believe that what they're going to learn from those people is more than what they can learn from a black man. Exactly. So I think that's one of the reasons why they're crazy about native speakers. Secondly, they think of their accent. I don't know if they just want to wake up one morning and start speaking like the no, Americans no, no. or the British. <laughs> because first of all, if you want to learn, English is not your main language. Thai is not my first language. So if I want somebody to speak to me in Thai, the person has to speak slowly for me to even try to get what the person is saying. Exactly. Another thing is that they don't really think that Africans are qualified or black people are qualified for the job because they look down on us. They, they, they really consider it as a thing when it comes to teaching their children and hiring their, their staff. Yeah, that's all. And I don't think all of that matters because if you think of the knowledge that is going to be passed down, if you think of how good this person can handle your students, how good is the information or the knowledge that this person is this person is passing before you can hire english is a medium of communication right yeah, yeah we use it to communicate with others mm -hmm. so um mr Bay, do you think that the accent of the person has anything to do with uh, the english language some people will say we want american accent some people will say we want english accent some people say we want canadian accent does it really have anything to do with uh, the mastery of the English language? <laughs> I don't think... <laughs> so, what? <laughs> I don't think the accent is, is important. The most important thing is the knowledge yeah. to pass on to the student. Mm -hmm. So when they are saying that um, they want someone who has an American accent, what could they be thinking about? They want them because if they work with, they say, oh, you have a white, and you're working with a white, just to have that pride. Yeah, yeah, that yeah pride just there. to have that pride. Yeah. They have a friend who is a that's white. Right. <laughs> I have a teacher who is a white, mm -hmm. of which that's not the knowledge that you pass to the students. Exactly. So um, talking about the employers or the directors of these schools that hire foreign teachers, right? Um, don't you think that it is like a business um, um, idea for them to hire a white teacher instead of a black teacher in order for them to boost their number of students to boost their businesses don't you think that might be one of the reasons why they go for a white teacher instead of a black teacher i don't think so because let me take for example in my school last Five years, they had Bhutanese, Filipinos were there. The students were dropping. Yeah. But as we came there, the students are more than previous years. For me, it's the knowledge. It's not the skin color. Might be the schools would argue that since the locals adores the white, so if we have a white in our school, it will impress them to send their kids to our school. Is that not a legitimate reason? What do you think? <laughs> no, it's for me, no. <laughs> it's not legitimate? No. Well, it's, it's, for me, it's not reason enough. Yeah. But for them, it might be reason enough because I don't know what they're thinking, but they just like white people. Yeah. And if their locals are interested in white people, okay. Why not employ a white man in your school so that <laughs> you can have more students and exactly. more money and more of everything? Yeah. 
But when the students end up not knowing anything, what becomes of your school? Well, it starts don't. dropping because <laughs> the parents will be, like, will be like, okay, they're going here, there's no white person, but there's another person who teaches very well and I can see results from this person. Why not send their, 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 their children there? So well, that's just how it is. And some directors, yeah. they end up hiring white people because here in Thailand, their life is like they live a community life. Exactly. So they think that if this person can capture this white man and the white man becomes their husband, they're going to get something from that person. And this white man can bring his friend over. Mm -hmm. It's not only going to boost the economy of their school, it's going mm -hmm. to boost the economy the country in general. Yeah, yeah. And after bringing that friend, the friend can bring another yeah. friend. So I don't think they're only looking at that one. Yeah, so they're also this, looking this at, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there was, yeah, there's another motive. Like they're looking at what they're going to get from these people. It's, it's always about what we are going to benefit from yeah, them. Yeah, it's always about what they are going to benefit. That's smart. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so uh, let's continue. Um, do you think that um, it's um, visible or is even morally correct for an employer to mention in an ad that he is looking for, quote unquote, a white teacher uh, in this day, age, and time? For me, a teacher is a teacher. Yeah. If you can teach the students very well, if they can understand you very well, I don't see any reason for a white or a black. Well, the, the employer will argue that you only say that because you are a black. Mm -hmm. So you are saying that you don't see any reason why he or she should mention that he or she wants a white teacher because you are a person of color. <laughs> <laughs> well, it all depends on what that person wants to gain from the white teacher. Exactly. To me, they should be looking for a professional teacher. You understand? Yeah, I get it. But maybe the person has had an experience. I don't want to discriminate. Maybe the person has had an experience with with a black teacher or a non-native speaker. And it wasn't they, good. Yeah, it wasn't good. And they don't just want that to happen again. Exactly. And so they think that, okay, maybe this white man can be better. Okay.